Well, folks, it's a good, good morning to you. Sunday morning. Had a hell of a good time last night with my new friends I met. I really saved those guys. They were, uh, they were stuck. They had came a long way, and uh, they had to go back a long way to find a place to stay. So I invited them. Uh, Invited them onto my campsite, and uh, it was great. We really had a good time, you know, a lot in common. I think that just goes with people that are outdoors people. Just right there have something big in common. That's a church bell. That was a church I used to go to with my mom and my dad and my sister when I was a little kid. It's like I told you in the past video, we'd be camping up here. And, uh, yeah, don't you know we got to get up Sunday morning, have breakfast, and uh, put on some good clothes, clean clothes? Now we're camping and go to church. Yep. No matter where we were camping, my dad knew where the nearest church was for Sunday morning, that's for sure. Anyhow... But, yeah, this was a great, great trip. I hope everybody enjoyed it. I know I did. Man, I'm spoiled after a three-nighter. Four days and three nights. Man, it's hard to say goodbye to that island right there. But, anyhow, folks... I hope you've enjoyed this series. I know it's been a long series and many parts to it, but that's just the way I did it, and that's the way I wanted to do it, and I believe that's the way I'm going to continue to do it. Anyhow, hmm. thanks a lot for watching. You guys and gals are the best. I'll show you where we're going. It's not a long path. Right back down the old Racket Lake supply store. That's it right down there in front. I don't know if you can make it out, but you can see the church steeple sticking up there to the left. All right, folks. This is it for this series on my trip to Racket Lake. Again, I hope you enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. I'll be talking with you soon.